I'm Norma Buchals and I'm the executive chef here at Brooks Winery and today we're going to be making the perfect pairing for November which is a truffled seared sea scallop with truffle scented broccolini and a garlic potato puree and it is paired with our 17 Highland Riesling. So the first thing we're gonna start with is a russet potato. Once you peel it, we are going to do a medium dice and just cook it in boiling water for anywhere from 10 to 12 minutes. Once it's drained, put all of the potato bits into a blender. We're gonna add a little bit of whole butter to that. And then we have a garlic infused cream sauce that is basically just a little bit of minced garlic and some heavy cream. And you're just gonna lightly simmer the garlic in the cream for about three to five minutes. And you are just going to strain the whole pieces of garlic out and add that into the potatoes in the blender. And you are going to puree until smooth. The next thing is we're going to take some blanched broccolini. You just blanch it in some water for about 30 seconds. These are U10 scallops, um, so they're quite large. And for this recipe, we are going to be using three per person. And we're just going to remove the foot on the side of the scallop. And we're just gonna lightly season them with a little bit of salt and pepper. The last thing we're gonna make is our truffle butter. You just wanna take a little bit, a couple tablespoons at room temperature, and you wanna take half of a truffle, and we are just going to take um, a microplane, and we are going to shave half of that truffle into the butter, and you're just gonna mix it up. So we're just gonna get the heat on, and just enough oil just to coat the bottom of the pan. So we're just going to gently add our scallops. And again, they're gonna cook for about 45 seconds or so per side for a nice medium rare. And that's exactly what you want. We're just gonna let them cook on the other side now. If you look over here, scallops are nice and golden brown. We're just gonna take those off and get the broccolini in here. So we're gonna turn the heat down a little lower and we're gonna take all of that truffle butter, throw that in. It's so aromatic, I love it. And we're just gonna throw our blanched broccolini right in there. And then, if you kind of tilt the pan towards you a little bit, you can kind of see the drippings are there. And you can totally take those and just pour them right on top. And you're just gonna warm those through just about a minute or two. And then we're going to be ready to assemble the dish. So this is our finished uh, garlic mashed potato puree. Still nice and warm. And we're just gonna take a little bit of this. Just gonna dab it right on there. You can kind of just smoosh it right on the plate, just like that. Then we're gonna take a couple pieces of the broccolini that we have. Next, we are going to take our scallops. And then I like to take a little bit of the leftover butter liquid that's in the pan. And I'm just gonna spoon some of that up, just about a tablespoon or so. And you can just lightly put that truffle butter sauce right on the top. And then to finish the dish, we are going to take our truffle and we're just gonna take these and just shave some fresh truffle right over the top. And of course, my absolute favorite, 
some edible flowers from our garden here. I'm gonna try it. It's really, <laughs> I say it a lot. It's really good though. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh my goodness. Cheers. Please come up and try this. You will not regret it. Oh my goodness. Mmm. I forgot. That's a whip. <laughs> I got a really good elastic band this time, so it's not cut loose. 